Hello, it's Noah, and welcome to iHollywood TV. Well, our next guest is one of the most successful actors in the faith-based genre. Great American Media announced the fifth installment of the best faith franchise of all time, in my opinion. God's Not Dead and God We Trust is streaming exclusively on Great American Pure Flix today. Please welcome back to iHollywood TV, my buddy David A.R. White. Hello, David. Welcome back. <laughs> I know. Good to see you. <laughs> it is so great to see you once again. Uh, by the way, Christmas has come early. We decided that we would put up our uh, Christmas holiday set, which is Disney themed. Uh, so we have all the little characters right around. Maybe we got Mickey and Donald and uh, Minnie. And uh, by the way, uh, you know, we're kicking off on, listen to this, David, on iHollywood TV in December, the 25 days of Fa La La holidays. Uh, so what do you think about that? I, 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 um, I don't know which one is you. Ah. This is the can't find Noah. It's like, where's Noah? Is it me over here? Is it me back here? Or is it me right over here? You know, so. <laughs> exactly. Which one is not a Disney character? Ah. <laughs> Only me. <laughs> anyway, and by the way, David, speaking of the holidays, what are some of the like rituals that you do each season with your family? You know, before we talk about this movie. <laughs> Well, you know, I mean, obviously, Christmas Eve service is, I, I think, one of the the the, oh, yeah. the best parts of the whole Christmas season. Um, the other thing is, is uh, Black Friday used to be, you know, when you would go to Walmart and buy all kinds of kids gifts for your children because you could just, you know, they have all these deals and then you can just um, wake them up really early and they love to do it and the whole thing. So, um, oh, yeah. Black Friday is not really a thing anymore. Now it's like it's yeah, all people like Cyber Monday all the time, uh, all 365 yeah. days of the year. You know, people just shop online. Yeah, so yeah. That, that that thing's you know I think kind of out, but um, but Christmas Eve service still remains. Thank God, it's the best. And, uh, and we actually open gifts on the on Christmas Eve. Oh, so. that's fun. Oh, I like that. You know, yeah. so many that's families do up. that now. Yeah, a lot of um, although you know, so many are Christmas only Christmas morning, so mm -hmm. it's always a was a thing now did your family let you believe in santa you know i don't i actually i think i kind of maybe believed oh in my it God, a little, i just told it away like <laughs> seven eight years old yeah yeah but not real i mean i i think all my kids figured out that santa didn't exist around even my my youngest is 11 yeah and um she still likes the concept of saying santa but yeah. i think she's, she's even on to the gig yeah <laughs> I think I, I'm the one that broke the secret to my sister. I told her, like, when we were in second grade, and she went to her room and started crying. I was like, oh, my, you know, I didn't mean to do that, you know. But, um, yeah, you know, I, I just found out from, I mean, you know, how kids talk at school. You know, they always, you know, oh, you know, Santa's this, Santa's that, you know. So, anyway, I broke the secret. But, anyway, but, <laughs> well, you're, it's. You're not taking the blame is what you're saying. Yeah. <laughs> Well, it's nice to see you once again, David. So aside from the holiday season and straight to the movie that so many really enjoyed this year, God's Not Dead and God We Trust was a hit. And first off, I want to know, you know, what do you really hope the audiences will take away from this movie that is different from previous God's Not Dead films? Yeah, you know, I mean, it had a good theatrical run. Um, it's been out of the theaters now for a little bit. And and uh, I think that the biggest thing was... Um, that stat that said 40 million American Christians uh, don't vote in presidential elections. Mm. Um, now, that stat, it's interesting because they brought it into the campaign. We've been hearing this, you know, throughout the campaign. And now they say 30 to 40 million, which in the hope is that, you know, 10, 10 of them uh, have already, maybe have already voted and, and uh, gone out and voted. But I think that's the thing. You know, we're, we're blessed in this country to have um, the ability to choose which, uh, who our leader is going to be, who our next leader is going to be. Yeah. And it doesn't matter whether, obviously, uh, you know, the uh, Christmas is all about Jesus Christ is the reason um, for love and for hope in, in America mm -hmm. and also in, in to the world. But, you know, we also have that those freedoms that we get to celebrate here in our country. And, and that's a crazy stat. You know, 15 million out of those aren't even registered to vote. So hopefully Isn't this election crazy? will change that. Yeah. yeah. That's, 
you know, th this movie is set against the the backdrop of an election. Mm -hmm. I run for Congress in it, but it's also not just an election movie. I do want to be clear about that. It's about it's about purpose. It's about dreams, and it's about where God takes you out of where you maybe think that um, you, you're not your comfort zone of where you don't want to go. And uh, a lot of times he says, no, for such a time as this, mm. you're going to go. And then it's, you know, it's better just to go. You know, as opposed to it has a really great storyline, uh, a great message too. I mean, all these, you know, God's Not Dead films in this franchise is, is just beyond incredible. I really like the messaging. You know, you leave after watching each movie feeling inspired, you know, feeling, uh, you know, that joy with inside of you. And, you know, what has been the most rewarding part, David, of creating faith driven, family friendly movies over the years as this all started back many you know, years ago for you? Yeah, um, I, I think it was, you know, it was. It, there's it's twofold because it's it's a fru in one sense it's a fruition of a dream that you know now every major studio for the most part have faith-based labels so mm -hmm. that is you know something that the lord put into my heart many 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 years ago probably before you were born and uh <laughs> <laughs> me and kevin downs and we you know we set out to start this whole um you know actually having a faith-based genre mm -hmm. and uh and so that I'm 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 blessed about that, but I'm also just amazed to see how much even the God's Not Dead franchise has has really um, uh, taken brought hope to people around the world. Yeah. Um, I have so many stories of being stopped in airports and and people coming up to me, whether it was Costco or Target or Walmart or airports or just out on the street. I was in the, out on the street in Colombia and in um, in uh, Cartagena of all things mm -hmm. and this woman ran up to me and kept saying pastor dave pastor dave and she had like three little kids it was at night um we were just going to a to dinner you know and and she was living on the streets but basically oh. basically saying how much this these movies had had um that was a recent one you know not that long ago and so it's that's the that's the amazing thing about them is that that god has a way he says my word will not come back void and he has a way of using it and putting it on each and everyone's life in different ways. And speaking of elections, you know, how important do you think this year's election is in our country? As I think we need to really encourage everyone to get out and go vote. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's it's weird because I'm a skeptic in a lot of different ways, right? Yeah. People are always, that now seems to be like, hey, is this is the election of a lifetime, right? Yeah. Never has it been so important to vote. And in part, you're like, oh, is it really <laughs> like, you know, like what's the skeptic in me is going to say? Does it matter? And I think and then that, that's something about this movie that I love is that, you know, sometimes in life we we go, does our mat do, does our life really matter so much of what we're doing every day? Because so many of our lives go into monotony, right? We, we're, we It seems like we're just doing something. I picked my daughters up to this morning like three or four different times already, you know? Um, and, and I've done things over and over and over again. And you wonder what difference does it make? But I think that's the whole purpose of life is that God has put us here for such a time as this. Mm -hmm. um, even in the mundane, we never know where God is going to use us for such a time as this. Mm. And I think that's the message that the movie um, resonates in so many ways that I love. You know, I, I mean, I, I think election season is such an exciting time, whether you're Republican, Democrat, independent, whatever, whichever line you're on. I mean, it's, it, it, it's so patriotic and, you know, it's exciting to actually get to cast your vote for someone, you know, regardless what aisle that you're on. And, you know, I, I think this movie could not have come at a better time. And, you know, lastly, David, God's Not Dead and God We Trust streams on Pure Flix today. Why should audiences be excited to catch this film right away on Great American? American Pure Flex. Well, you know, it, it's pretty cool that Great American Pure Flex has, all, I think, all the God's Not Dead's on. It's the only place that has all of them on it that you can watch one after the next, after the next, and not have to pay another, you know, $22 to watch <laughs> the next one, um, like on Amazon or something like that. Oh, that's true. Uh, uh, but but um, the heart of, you know, that's, it's, it's, it's at the heart of, um, of, of Great American Pure Flex. 
that I think is so important. And even in, in all the holiday movies and everything, it's it's to remind us of the reason for the season, first and foremost, yeah. right, which is Jesus. And then the second thing is uh, it's to inspire and to 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 breathe hope and inspiration into people through whatever movie that they're watching on that platform. And um, and for that, I'm I'm thrilled to be part of that and happy that our movies are still playing there. Well, David, it's always so nice to have you on my platform. This is a great gift for all of you to watch this holiday season. Be sure to catch God's Not Dead and God We Trust streaming exclusively on Great American Pure Flix today. Go check it out. Thank you, David, for coming back on iHollywood TV. I always enjoy you when you get to come on. Thanks again, Noah. I appreciate it. God bless you, brother.